What's up, y'all? Got a family feed, so let's get into this tea. We're about to get into clocking with Chris. Corey got out sad, going out sad. Clarence need to put a ring on it. I don't know. I ain't even tired. Let's get it. Chris Tess is now doing clocking with Chris when he's talking about everyone, so of course he had to start with Queen and Clarence first. I'm just saying things that y'all thinking that some people scared to say. I don't like bro with her. I want her to be happy and go love twin. I'm not stuck on her. I'm not I swear to God on my kids, I'm not. I put this on everything I love. Anybody that knows me know I don't I don't care. I don't hey. care about what she got going on, what he got going on. I've been past that. It's been six, seven plus years. But my thing is if I'm gonna talk about something, I'm gonna talk about it. But I don't really like them. I'm just being honest. She can go do way better than bro. I'm just being honest. I don't even think bro came out with a clothing line since he first met her. He's been talking about the clothing line for six, seven years. That was funny. That was fucking up. I'm just being honest, and then I don't know how. I'm just be. I'm just being honest. I get that you're trolling, but Clarence has been a good person to your son. And while you asking for your son to pay you back, CJ is also telling Clarence that he gonna pay him back. Which Clarence know he not gonna pay him back, but it still don't stop him from taking your son to Best Buy and buying him whatever he want. So before you start stepping on the toes of the man that play football with your son, understand that Clarence might not be what you want him to be, which is Queen's fiance slash husband. But he damn sure been better than with. Let me tell y'all something. This hug right here. It's way different from the beginning. And in the beginning, like I told Honey Sauce, baby, if you ain't got no kids, you just don't know. If you don't have kids, you just don't know. But baby, this hug right here. What you what? Now, so before you start stepping on the toe, stop. He hug him CJ every chance also to get, Clarence no? that he going to pay him back, which Clarence know he not going to pay him back, but it still don't stop him from taking your son to Best that, Buy that's and buying him whatever right he now. Want. So before you start stepping on the toes of the man that play football with your son, understand that Clarence might not be what you want him that's to be, which hug. is Queen's fiance slash hug. That's a hug right there. Clarence could barely hug the nigga back in the beginning, but only because I feel like, you know, with kids, I be nervous myself. Like, Get off me. I always tell them, get your ass. <laughs> but no, realistically, they love you. And they happy that you, you know, look out for them. That's all a kid need. They can't handle it right now. Let Can you buy it for me right now? <laughs> I'll pay you back when I get some money type shit. So, shout out to Clarence for being a good fucking dad. Husband, but he damn sure been better than what you will ever be when it come to Queen. <laughs> now, clock that tea. Y'all leave y'all comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to oh, I know to exactly what he Chris was. also speaks on Brooklyn and TT situation. Y'all know TT boyfriend shoe. Aries is cool with Jay Cinco, and they were doing double dates together, which Bella and TT became cool. And a lot of people feel like TT owe Brooklyn loyalty by not being friends with Bella or doing double dates with Jay Cinco. Now, y'all leave y'all comments down below when it comes to that. But Chris Sales, while reporting on that, that situation compared that situation to his situation with Armand and Trey, Queen and Clarence, where Armand and Trey started hanging out with Clarence more than him, and he felt like they owed him yep. loyalty, even though yeah, back right, then Ashley. he was hinting at that. But he also said that he didn't have a problem. When them babies love you, they do. Ain't a damn thing you can do about it. I'm with it. Because I know me personally, right? I had a situation like that happen too, because, you know, when uh, Armand and Trey, they hung out, you know, they had to hang out with Clarence, because obviously they were still cool with... Uh, you know, uh, my ex and shit. So, and I, ne I never had a problem with it. I personally don't see nothing wrong with it. You know, as long as you feel me, like as long as y'all ain't talking shit about me and you, you feel me? Especially if you was my brother first and shit like that. So I, I personally don't see nothing with, uh, wrong with it. Let me know what you That's the only part he lied about. Sure thing. Someone said, I would probably say I don't care publicly, but privately I'll be mad as fuck. Chris Hills responded, no for real, because I'm lying in this video. I was mad when I saw it mid, uh -huh. which I think he's talking about on my hanging out with bro. Y'all leave my comments down below. Would you be mad if your close friend was hanging out with your ex boo and mad as fuck? Mad as hell. Yes, I would. Just thought y'all would know the correct way of the math problem we were doing. Oh, thanks, honey sauce. Okay, wait, what is it? Yeah. Good morning. Good afternoon. Work in a mission. This is how you do the math problem. Let's see. Because let me tell you something. Something wrong. Welcome to class. This seems like we got to get back in school. Some of y'all, the first bus y'all see in the morning, I'm going to need you to hop on it, baby. I don't know what's going on. So the shade room. Friend. Oh, shit. What Damn. happened? No, 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 no. Morning, Friend, we don't use this in real life. It really don't matter, but let's get into it. Afternoon, welcome to class. This seems like we gotta get back in school. Some of y'all, the first bus y'all see in the morning, I'm gonna need you to hop on it, baby. I don't know what's going on. So the shade room posted this little problem right here, and it got y'all in shambles. It got y'all so toe up from the floor, and it's honestly kind of sad because how y'all don't remember how to do pimp dies? How y'all don't remember pimp dies? How y'all don't remember pimp dies? Please excuse my dear Aunt Sally. Y'all don't remember your dear Aunt Sally? Excuse her. Like, what's going on? Okay. 
Okay, parentheses. The correct way to do it first. Hurry up. And then I'm gonna show you all the other ways how people was trying to say it in the comments and all this. Somebody gonna tell me that I failed my student. How you gonna tell me as a math teacher who teach math right now today that I failed my student? Excuse me? What's going on over here? Right, parentheses, X on is multiplication, division, addition, and subtraction. I keep telling y'all up is the multiplication, division, addition, subtraction. Uh, These right. two are interchangeable. If, if we read the problem left to right, Whichever one comes first, that's what you do first. So let's go ahead and follow the order Left of operations. Left and right. Parentheses first. Do we have parentheses? Yes, we do. What do we have in parentheses? Two plus three. What's two plus three, everybody? Five. Thank you. Thank you. All thank you. Right. Thank you. We can put that in parentheses. Thank you. Right. Oh, we even put it in parentheses. That's problem. Problem. Yes. So yes, we still together. do parentheses. Yes. So it'll be five, plus, five times twenty. Times 20. No, we do not have any exponents. Now we get to multiplication and division. Now five we times twenty. I said we have multiplication and we have division. Multiplication. Which one do no, we have first? No, you do. Division. division. We have to do left to right. Even though division. division comes after multiplication, it's left to right. Whichever one comes first. So let's go ahead and we're going to do that. I'm going to uh, divide by four, everybody. Wait, wait, wait. Nine. If it's left to right, whatever. But, no. If it's left to right, whatever comes first, why do we do two plus three first? Because it's parentheses, right? Wouldn't that be confusing to one that you would say, and you only do left to right? I fucking hate school math. We don't even use this in real life. If we use left to right, why are we doing parentheses first? That's number one. Number two, boom, we get the parentheses out the way and put it and put the five into some more parentheses, by the way. So, boom, two plus three equals five. Boom, parentheses, put it five in parentheses. Now we're going to the left. Why we didn't go to the left in the beginning? Why didn't we go to the left in the beginning? I'm fucking sick of it. Pam does. Pam does. <sighs> Continue. 25, 50, 75, 100. Yes, it's going to be 25. We have 25 times 5. Now we can do our multiplication. 25. I hope Jamie ain't in here either. Times 5, everybody, is a good number of 125. And this is how we get 125. I'm not understanding. Again, the very first bus you see in the morning. If you did not get 125, let's go ahead and get on there. <laughs> now, somebody said, what if it's a fraction? If it's a fraction, it's the same thing. 100 divided by 4 is 25. 2 plus 3 is 5. 25 times 5 is 125, okay? Fraction is the same thing, babe. Nothing changes. Now, people who got 5. I want the first thing you do is to distribute. You have multiple <laughs> operations in one problem. That's when you follow the order. I got 5. First operations. Why would you start with distributing? Who told you to do that? Who said that? Who this fuck? Thank you. But I do see how y'all got five. You should be four times two, which is eight. Four times three, which is 12. 12 plus I'm not going to lie. That's what I instantly wanted to do. Actually, I wanted to do 100 divided by four. No cap. That's actually what I did initially. Then I would have did five times two. Okay. Which is 10 plus three. That would have been 13. But let's not talk about it. It is 20. 100 divided by 20 is five. I see how you may have gotten there, but we must follow the order of five. How about this, friend? Let's talk about the fact that this ain't even used in real life. And poor children, because if they look at me right now and go to school and be like, this ain't even used in real life. I had to calm down on saying that to my children because they still got to go to school. I'm telling my kid, fuck that shit. Then they was doing that. Fuck it, mom. You said fuck it. I said fuck it too. No, 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 no. Wait, you still got to pass. <laughs> you, you still got to pass. Y'all don't want to go to homeschool, bet. You still got to pass it. <laughs> I completely flipped it. No, no. Go to school, do it right. <laughs> now they be like, all right, the bitch said do it right. Five times five in the parentheses and the division. Okay? <laughs> Fuck school. <laughs> I'm on the gas and bitch, I'm moving fast. It ain't no stop, but these niggas, man, I'm really on the ass. Appreciate the resub, friend, but for real. We have to follow the order of our branch. And fuck him. <laughs> okay, what was we watching? What was we watching? Okay. And their new boo. Leave out, we was only two minutes in voice video. Throw it down below because oh, I definitely want to know. In an old video, oh, someone did this oh. to Corey. Oh. Appreciate the resub, friend. Hey, I I'd be saying hey, that to oh, teacher if I'm not a teacher. Where am I? Gone. Use this. <laughs> I'm not a teacher. Where I am? Where am I gonna use this? Nowhere. Nowhere. 
Big fan, man. It's my guy, Big Boogie, in this motherfucker. Let's go. Hey, appreciate it, appreciate it. My guy, Big Boogie, in this motherfucker, man. Big Boogie. <laughs> Carmen is currently supporting her man Big Boogie on tour and Corey is still trolling. He said that Big Boogie was in his girl Danny's DMs recently. Here's what Danny had to say. You know, just trying to for a they don't understand what's really what's happening. Nah, uh, no, facts. But yeah, bro, it's all love, man. Man, I'm really, I'm just trying to be honest, and I'm not even a messy person. I'm so tired of y'all talking about that boogie situation. Let me tell you something. I can drop some DMs right now from boogie, but boogie ain't nobody. I miss this. I'm just gonna be honest, like. Supposedly Danny and Big Boogie been friends for a while and Danny asked Big Boogie to do a pop-up at her store and he said that he was gonna charge her $20,000. I really don't think he wanna do it and I think that's why he's charging her $20,000. But y'all leave y'all comments down below. Danny also explained why she's with Corey now. I don't care about what y'all say. Y'all really put us together. Cause I wasn't even thinking about being with Corey. I think y'all hated him so much. And this your bed too? Why you ain't tell me about it, Zara? Big Boogie been friends for a while and Danny asked Big Boogie to do a pop-up at her store and he said that he was going to charge her $20,000. I really... Where did you get this video from? I really don't think he would to do it and I think that's why he's charging her $20,000. But y'all leave y'all comments down below. Danny also explained why she's with Corey now. I don't care about what y'all say. Y'all really put us together. Cause I wasn't even thinking about being with Corey. I think y'all hated him so much and y'all hate me so much y'all might as well hate us together. <laughs> Simple as that. But we're going to get our money in the midst of all of it. So, y'all did that. We didn't do nothing. I was trying to tell y'all in the beginning, we was just friends. Y'all wasn't buying this shit. So I was like, hey, fuck it. They think I talk to you anyway, so come on, let's do it, friend. So yeah, it's like, you all do, the internet does stuff like this. You put people together. Like, people that don't even supposed to be together. Like, Zara, where she put this at? Yeah, that's what y'all do. Maddie has a new boo, and recently she went on a date on live, and a lot of people think her new boo is chaotic. She just told me to pass on her boo, please. She didn't say thank you, she don't lie. Thank you, baby. She got you, nigga. You see, I thought she said no. Thanks, thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You gotta emphasize your baby. No, see, she's soft with it. You gotta be soft with it. And we gotta be aggressive with it. No, you be soft with it too. Now, Maddie and Chaotic might be a little messy media hookup because Chaotic used to be friends with Danny because before Corey was riding around in her Rolls Royce, Chaotic was riding around in her Rolls Royce and supposedly they were supposed to be just quote unquote friends. So Maddie might be doing this to get back at Danny or Corey. Who knows? Y'all leave that comments down below. Let me know what y'all thinking when it comes to that. Corey and Danny was out having dinner and they got into an altercation where Danny ended up popping Corey in the face. Now you need to put my goddamn glasses up. Oh. You need to put my glasses up. <laughs> now you need to come put my glasses up for real, for real, because you pay too damn much. <laughs> like that shit ain't funny. Man, that girl slapped the shit out of me over here, man. Like she gonna get mad at me because we were joking. <laughs> we joking and she gonna, and I, I, I want to joke back to my fucking cardio. I'm gonna come put my glasses up. <laughs> Motherfucker, stop, stop me. Stop my glass, clean my goddamn face. Y'all wanna talk about something? I'll be my hands on motherfuckers. I'm just saying. Man. Why you gotta go live and tell a lie? I'm going live and tell a lie. Why you gotta go happen. live? Man, go on, watch your business now. Get my glass, get my glass here. I'm not getting nothing. Come on, man, get my glass. Why you gotta go live? Man, them motherfuckers slapped the dog shit out of me just then. Boy, I'm talking about she hit me so fucking hard, but I seen my sister and she did. That's crazy. Oh my god. She ain't funny, bro. Man, I'm not picking my glasses up, bro. You let me drop, bro. Let me drop coming. It's on the way, bro. Please, thank you. Yeah. Cause I'ma need it. Girl, that pimp shot the shit out me just did, yeah. man. Yeah, <laughs> boy. I got a Mississippi woman, boy. This shit ridiculous. My gun glued to my hip. I done like to use that bitch tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, the gun shit is Ooh, crazy. Shit, my eye it, burn it. Man, I'm talking the about. I don't, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. I don't tolerate this here. I don't want to do this here. I don't, like, I don't like that about time my ass. I don't like. See, this is that shit I be talking about, bro. You don't be up like that. So you gotta be the first one that go last. Mm -hmm. That's what you trying to do? You better leave me alone, daddy. You know, what did you mean? Just leave me alone now. Why you play so much then? You ain't gonna put your hand on me. You gotta broke the car to the ass. What's up? Joking. Y'all want so some, uh, some queso or something to start off with? Yeah. Like a small queso? Whatever she want. Yellow or 
Whatever she wants. I don't want to pay for Okay. But she can't eat chainsaw because she be constipated. Okay, I got you. Chill, chill, chill. Chill. Yeah. Thank you. I'm chill. I can't eat chainsaw as a Danny. I mean, I can, but I'm going to feel like I'm going to die tomorrow. I'm going to die tomorrow. I ain't even know that girl all that fucking long. Like, the way she reached out that table and shot that shit out of me just then, bro. Like, this shit fucking ridiculous. Yeah, I'm going to get off live. 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 I'm going to get we was, um, I was ordering my food, and he just kept, like, you know, I'm the type of person, like, you know, I got my moments all ready to play, but then again, when somebody takes my phone and some business shit come about, I be serious as fuck. So, I'm getting my little to-do list and shit ready for my business and shit, and I already ain't checked on my mental health facility in, like, two weeks, so I've been, like, checking on my facility and shit. So I'm Corey wanna sit up here and play. Like he just like what he did. I ain't cheating. I'm not giving He got the fucking napkin, was tearing it apart and balling it up and just kept throwing shit at me. So I'm like, bro, stop playing. Like I'm over here trying to do something on my phone. So next thing you know, shit. Yeah, man, that motherfucker reached by the table, slapped me so hard, y'all see my dead sister. I see my dad's sister, I never thought I'd see her so vividly. She's 24 years old now, that's 25. <laughs> she beautiful too. Jermaine, this your video ran? <laughs> I see my sister, gang. Look at my eye. You made the video, you made this shit seven days ago too? I'm just going to cock out of already. <laughs> <laughs> She's laughing at me, shut my feelings. I don't want to smoke. My eyes still jumping here. Ding, 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 ding. My eyes. Damn. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. jumping right now. They scared of me. Look at that. God damn, this is jumping. Oh. I'm going to take this shit. Then, so when I slapped you, y'all, first of all, the glasses were flying. First of all, the glasses said, the glasses, the glasses. Big ass glasses fly off your face. Second of all, his reaction was, he grabbed his phone. I'm popping it. You ready? I'm popping it. Down now. You popping it. Get out of here. Get me out of here. You glad my big ass glasses went to flying? How you feel? Yeah, they went to flying, and the first thing you did was you was paying your pockets because you couldn't see. <laughs> you couldn't see, so you kept paying your pockets for your phone. Like, I'm finna go lie. I'm finna go lie. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, you fucking snitch, man. I ain't gonna lie. Uh -huh. I'm a snitch now, huh? Mm -hmm. I'm a snitch, I'm trying to save my life. Yeah. Mini girl. You know, you're doing the right thing now. When I slap your ass, you just go live. There's an echo on their video, not mine. So by the time, you know, they can't say they, they only gonna say Danny, he beat me dance too. So what it is what it is. That's what you doing. You, you first wanna go live. It's cool, you learn the lesson. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? I ain't tripping. I'm going to the police station next. It was a, it was a, it was an echo that night. Yeah. Oh, you go to the police station on me and all this shit I got going. I'm killing you. You ain't going to make it there. You know I'm alive, right? I you going to jail. Shit, you be dead. I'll be cool. I'm going to lay down my 20 years. Okay, guys. I'm going to be careful. I'm going to die. I don't want to die. I don't want to die right now, baby. Oh, dang Please, let me live a little bit longer. I got kids. I got a few boys. I try to have them by you, too. Nah, you ain't have no baby by me. I asked you to close one. I thought we I thought that we got lemon drops tonight. Drink some cheers. Cheers. What was it? This, this go find is me or Renee coming from Sheila. Name an animal that starts with the letter. Your ass might be sitting up there getting your ass whooped. I might got some <laughs> I was about to say, we already watched this anyway. 11 11 in the chat. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm knowing this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.